Got another set here. In our choices, we have looks like ions of various kinds. And let's look at the questions. A type of ion found in aluminum oxide. So aluminum, here it's going to be useful to find the oxidation states or the charges of these particular uh, members of the compound. So aluminum, aluminum is here. And if you remember, this doesn't really follow trends too well because aluminum is really the only example that we work with uh, in these kind of compounds. But you got to remember that Al as an ion is Al3+. So this is going to be Al3+. Oxide is almost always minus 2. Uh, rare exceptions, but almost always minus 2. You can pretty much trust it's going to be minus 2. So what compound does this form? Well, Al3 plus O2 minus. I like doing the cross multiplication method. So you just move the charges down there and you get Al2 O3. But the problem just wants to know what type of ion is found. So what type of ion? Well, we've got a metal 3 plus and a non-metal 2 minus. So the only choice that fits that is choice C. So this is going to be choice C. A type of ion found in potassium phosphate. Well, potassium is group one. It's rare earth. So it's going to be, or alkali earth, it's going to be a plus one. Sorry, not alkali earth, alkali metal. And it's going to be plus one, always. So we know potassium is plus one. Phosphate, this is a polyatomic ion, right? It's multiple atoms together to form one group that also has a charge. And something also you need to remember is this PO4, three minus. So we look at the choices. We need to look for a singleton uh, cation, right? plus one cation, or a polyatomic ion with minus three. Uh, well, here it is, A, right? Here is our singleton K plus right here. Notice that we have a XO4, but it's two minus instead of three minus. So E doesn't work for this one. A type of ion found in sodium acetate. So sodium, just like potassium, is an alkali metal. So it's plus one always. Acetate is CH3COO negative one. So this is not even anywhere close to anything here. So we can discount that. And again, Na plus, well, that's just A. So in fact, we have A twice on this one. Uh, so important thing to remember is know your charges, know your oxidation states based off of the periodic table. And you got to know your polyatomic ions so that you can kind of swap them in and out as you need them.